Morning, hon. Here's your breakfast for today. Mom, do you have eyes? I can't eat this. I didn't pick that. Your soulmate did. Ugh, that's disgusting. Can I just eat something else? No, you're only allowed to eat what they choose for you. Do you have a pencil I can borrow? No. Damn, I was just asking for a pencil. Sorry, I'm so hangry. My soulmate didn't give me any breakfast. That sucks. Mine gave me a charcuterie board. Um, is that a jar of mayo? It's not even regular mayo. It's the vegan kind. Maybe they're a vegan. I'm not eating a jar of mayo for lunch. Does this kid hate me? Can I have it? I love mayo. Ew. Come on, at least give me a side or something. Are you kidding me? Minced garlic? Bro thinks I'm a vampire. You don't like garlic? I eat it with a spoon. You can have it. Weirdo. They haven't even given me any water. Who cares? I only drink Dr. Pepper. I don't care about the rules. I need water now. No, don't do that. What? What's gonna happen? You can only eat what they choose forever now. Here's your <sighs> breakfast, sweetie. Finally, this bagel isn't moldy. Oh, just kidding. It actually is. I'm starving. What if I just keep ignoring what they tell me to eat? I wouldn't do that if I were you. I wish I got a shark coochie board. Sticking out your gut for the Rizzler. What are you singing? Please stop. It hurts my ears. Sorry, have you got any real food yet? No, they're definitely trying to kill me off. Good, you're so annoying. I think this is uncooked pasta. You should try it. Maybe it's good. Mm. No way, dude, I was just kidding. Why can't you just ignore your soulmate and eat whatever you want? My mom told me not to. Aw, do you always listen to what your mommy tells you? No. Ugh, refried beans, come on. Mmm, I'd slurp those up with a straw. I can't do this anymore. Give me one of those grapes. No, haven't you learned anything? Why does it taste like that? It switches your taste buds. Great. I have to find them so that they'll give me real food before it's too late. Good luck. You have nothing to go off of. I don't know, my arm is starting to look real tasty. No, your breakfast is here. Mom, this is a can of cat food. Yeah, but there's cheddar in it. You're married, how did you and dad find each other? It took many, many years. I can't wait that long. The only way to find out is to break into the factory. I've never committed a crime, but there's a first time for everything, thanks. More cat food? What is wrong with you? Excuse me, do you need something? Hi, I'm here for a uh, maintenance checkup. Oh, go right on in. That was way too easy. Hey, what are you doing back here? Stay back. Are you threatening me with a bottle of Febreze? I need to find out who my soulmate is. That's what everyone says who doesn't want to do the work. They haven't fed me in days. Why didn't you say that? That's illegal. Looks like your soulmate is Jack Smith. Jack? That little bitch. Jack, I need to talk to you right now. Oh, hey, have you met my new girlfriend, Macy? Your girlfriend? I've been feeding her five course meals all week. So just curious, what have you been giving to your soulmate then? The trash from whatever my girlfriend has. If you don't mind, we're gonna go eat some Wagyu. That's like a hundred dollars a piece. My princess deserves the best. So, did you tell him? No, I didn't tell him. I don't want him. Can I just like switch soulmates? No, dude, you can't. A single peanut? What am I, a squirrel? At least it's edible. This is the only real food he's given me in days. You need to do something. Wait, I should trick him. Seriously, can't you just tell him like a normal person? No. Hey, Macy, are you allergic to anything by chance? I'm super allergic to peanuts. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. That sucks. Bye. Jack, I have something to tell you. It's so important. Sure, what's up? Your girlfriend just told me she loves peanut butter. It's her favorite thing ever. I didn't know. Thank you for telling me. <gasps> yes, it worked. This is the best day of my life. You're insane. Hey, I need to talk to you right now. I'm kind of busy. You set me up. I did not set you up. You told me that she loves peanut butter. That's what she said. She's deathly allergic to it. Oh, I must have misheard her. Sorry. Are you insane? Where'd you even get that peanut the butter? The grocery store? Yeah, right. You were mocking me because you've always had a crush on me. I do not like you. Ugh, everyone likes me. You are so delusional. It's honestly brave. Whatever. That peanut butter wasn't enough. I'm still hungry. You should get lunch in a sec. Where's my food? Uh, there's nothing there. Nothing? I didn't even know you were allowed to do that. How long can humans go for without food? I think it's like two hours or something. You just need to talk to him. Don't you think it's a little late for that? There must be another way. There is no other way. With a magic potion, you can turn the table so you choose what he Who eats. Who are you? I'm no one. Bye. Maybe I should listen to her. Are you insane? You're probably hallucinating. What is this? It's the potion the old lady was talking about before. But why is it brown and chunky? No balls. You won't drink it. What did she say? Wait, dude, I was kidding. How did it taste? Oh my god, that was foul. Wait, it worked? Maybe the old lady was real and you weren't hallucinating. <laughs> I get to pick for him now. That was so worth it. You almost threw up. Soulmate eats raw fish or a hamburger. 
<laughs> You're not getting good food. Dog food or broccoli? This one's payback for the cat food. Come on, don't you think that's a little harsh? Like I haven't been starving for the past couple days? You're gonna make him sick. Good. Jack, could you answer number four for the class? Oh, I... Ew. I'm so sorry, my soulmate's been giving me rotten food all day. Dude, I told you. You have to give him water, he was throwing up. Do I though? Yes, that's like really bad. No, I don't think I'm done yet. Jack, if your soulmate is putting you in danger, you can report it as an emergency. Then the turns will restore. You can what? Yeah, she is putting me in danger. No one told me that. I mean, you did trust a random old grandma. Emergency reported, shit. You've dug yourself a hole this time. I can't starve for the rest of my life. I need my Chick-fil-A. Seriously, that's what you're worried about? Just go tell him. Okay, fine. Jack, you need to think about your soulmate. Why should I? She was trying to kill me. Because if you keep not giving her any food, she could die. Good. I hope she does. I don't want her. Actually, I'm going to send her her lunch right now. No, don't pick anything. Ah! Why am I a girl? No, I'm definitely a girl right now. Honey, get down here. You're going to be late for school. Uh, I can't. I have my period. Don't be silly. Just put a tampon in. Come on. Why does it look like a weapon? We have to go now. Get dressed. Hey, bro, what's up? Did you see the game last night? Um, what? I mean, nothing. <laughs> Bye. You have got to be joking. What are you wearing? What? What do you mean? I've never seen you wear anything but pink. Does your hat say milk? Yeah, you know it. Give me one. No, I'm not gonna give you one. Whatever, let's go. We have to watch over the new cheerleaders. The cheerleaders? Because we're the captains. Don't tell me you don't remember. Of course I remember. Hey, why don't you come demonstrate the cheers with me? No, I'm good. I'm feeling sick, but I love watching. Okay, if you say so. What's the matter, towel boy? Aren't you gonna pick that one up? What a loser. Oh, shit. Do you have anything to trade for lunch? Are you seriously going to eat all of that? Bitch, excuse me? No, like, I'm just saying I could never eat that much, but good for you trying to bulk up for the winner. What is wrong with you? Bailey, Amy, hey, what's up? Hey, Chad, we were just talking about that time Amy literally peed her pants from laughing. Yo, it was like a long time ago, right? No, it was like super recently. Stop talking! It's just a joke. Calm down. You guys get it, right? Yeah. <laughs> I am so cold. Oh, you're cold? Do you want to wear my jacket then? <sighs> no, I couldn't wear it. I'm just so tiny and small. I'm going to drown in it. Oh, I'm going to kill you. I'm like so dumb. I do not understand this math at all. Dude, you have a 4.0. Oh, I totally get it. Do you want help? Yeah. Could you be my tutor? My shoe does not fit right. Uh, that reminds me of the time that Amy got such a bad foot fungus. The doctor said it literally couldn't be cured. Okay, that's it. I'm about to swing. Gosh, guys, help. She's trying to fight me. I think I'm missing a finger. Dude, your finger is still there. You're just bending it. Oh. Hey, what's three plus three? 30. Yeah, yeah, that's so right. Yay! Today, you'll be working on the cash register. What's cash? I've always loved your sense of humor. Could I get a number four? I can't count that high. Okay, then could I get a number one? A number three? No, I said number one. Oh, I'm sorry, a number three. No, what is wrong with you? Who's in charge here? I need to speak to your manager. I don't know what that word means. Ugh, then what's your name? I don't know. They're just hiring anyone these days. Oh, wait, <laughs> I remembered. Okay, great. Then what is it? What is what? I can't do this. I have to go. Okay, bye. Have a good day. Bailey, you're fired. What does that mean? You no longer have a job here. Cool. Did you steal my shirt again? If I could rearrange the alphabet, I'd put you and I together. Ew, you're disgusting. Did it hurt? Um, did what hurt? When you fell from heaven. That was the worst thing I've ever heard in my entire life. Do you have a pencil I can borrow? Are you from Tennessee? Um, no, I'm from Massachusetts. Because you're the only 10 I see. Never say that again. Hello, are you okay? What is wrong with you? Do you know CPR? Because you're taking my breath away. Excuse me while I go throw up. What is wrong with you? Do you have a name? Yes, it's Bartholomew. Shh. I can call you mine. I would rather go bald. Do you play soccer? Uh, no, I play lacrosse. Because you look like a keeper. Do people have mute buttons? Because I need one. Hey, flirt with me too. I think you might be lacking some vitamin me. I don't know about that, but I can give you this vitamin D, huh? Ugh, my mouth tastes like salmon. Who eats fish for breakfast? Oh my god, I don't think that's fair. Why are you <laughs> chugging water like a toddler? Are you okay? No! I think my soulmate's doing something that I really don't want to be a part of. What could they possibly be doing? Never mind. I thought this was cherry. Why does it taste alcoholic? 
Who does shots at 2 p.m., bro? Get a grip! <coughs> oh my... Please don't tell me that was the devil's lettuce. Is my soulmate Chuck Bass? I'm so confused. Your soulmate is really putting you through it, huh? I am going through it and I'm afraid of what's next. My soulmate just ate mochi. It was so good. Oh, this one's really weird. It tastes like, um, like metal a little bit. Why would they eat metal? Oh my God. Sis, did you forget to flush the toilet again? It stinks. She's not even home. What is that? Do they live on a farm? Oh, why does it smell like that? I'm just gonna do this for the rest of the day. Hey guys, what's up? Dude, why are you plugging your nose like that? You don't wanna know. You can't just hold your nose for the rest of the day. Yes, I can, and I will. I won't talk to you if you keep doing that. Ugh. I regretted that immediately. What are you freaking out about? It smells like pee. It's not your soulmate's fault. They're probably just walking outside. But I have to deal with it too. Not the fish again. Oh, I know what they're doing. They're a freak. What the f I can't do this anymore. Ah, why is it spicy? You are being so dramatic. I'm gonna throw up. Headphones, what? I don't want these. Wait, did these let me hear what my soulmate is hearing? I love being nosy. The total today for your hemorrhoid cream is 100. I don't think I was supposed to hear that conversation. Maybe it'll be better this time. Bro, did you ever get that crazy rash on your ass figured out? I think I'm gonna put these away. My soulmate was looking at engagement rings for me. An engagement ring? But you haven't even met yet. I heard him tell the seller he was buying it for his soulmate. So has your soulmate said anything fun? I don't know, I haven't put them on yet. Are you crazy? Put them on right now. You have to hear what they're doing. Okay. Oh yeah, baby, that's the spot. Ah! What, what were they saying? Is it bad? I gotta go, I'm gonna go wash out my ears with bleach. Ew, what is on your face? What, what do you mean? Look at yourself. What is that? Your hand must have slipped while you did eyeliner. I didn't do it, why would I mess with my nose contour like this? Okay guys, let's not fight. Your soulmate probably did it. What, did they draw on me in my sleep? No, whatever your soulmate draws on themselves shows up on you too. And done. Dude, why would you do that? It looks so bad. It was already bad. Hey, Bailey, nice butt chin. What? I do not have a butt chin. You literally have a butt drawn on your chin. Oh, this means war. Let's see how they like that. You spelled regrets wrong. I did. Bailey, what is on your face? Go to the office now. But I didn't even do it. Oh, don't worry. Your counterpart's in the office already. Okay, I'll go. I can be adopted by a billionaire or a baker. Hey, what does billionaire mean? It must be someone who has like a billion friends. Wow, okay. Oh my, why have they given me a clearance child? And what are you wearing? I don't know. Go put this on this instant. This seems fancy. Yes, well, it's better than the Walmart clothes you're wearing. Much better. And this is our butler, Gerald. He'll take care of whatever you want. You have to get me anything I ask for? Yes, miss, that's right. Can I have an electric guitar? Yes, I will get on that right now. Here you go, one electric guitar. Sweet, thank you. So, what do you do for a job? Uh, I run a very big business. What kind of business? This is not bonding time, you don't need to know. I will not answer any personal questions about myself. Now go sit down for dinner, the private chef has made a five course meal. For dinner tonight, we're having escargot. Isn't that like the bottom of a plane? Oh my, no, that's cargo. Escargot is snails. Snails? I don't want to eat snails. Then you may have some caviar instead. What's caviar? Well, it's fish eggs. <clears throat> do you guys have like chicken tenders? No, of course we do not have chicken tenders. Bro, you're seriously eating a snail right now. Good for you, slay. We're going to need a tutor to fix your grammar immediately. What's wrong with how I talk? You sound like you have three brain cells total. Tomorrow you will be starting at a private school. Cool. At my old school, one of the teachers got arrested for money laundering. Okay, let's not repeat that again. It's a school for the rich and talented. Every person there is gifted. I am neither of those things. This will be your uniform. There's a uniform? Of course there's a uniform. It's a private school. I'm gonna look like a dork. That's great. I hope so. You look so much better. I look silly. Well, that's because you didn't button it up all the way. See, isn't that great? This is worse. Now, now, we have to get going. Class, this is our new student, Bailey. Hey, guys. 
Hey, isn't your father crazy, Mr. Carlson? Mm, I don't know. He seems pretty nice to me. Do you know what he does for work? He won't tell me anything about his job. Yeah, because he does super illegal things. My father gave me Wagyu when I asked for escargot. Can anyone trade? Mm, no, I can't. How about you, new girl? I have a Lunchable for lunch. Anyway, have you been down into your basement yet? Basement? Yeah, dude, everyone is always talking about what he keeps down there. No, I didn't even know that we had one. You need to go down there and tell us about all the crazy things. Like what? I'm assuming you had a great first day of school. It was fine, I guess. Have you made any worthy friends? You could say that. Can I ask you something? Of course, as long as it's not about my job. Well... No, you are not allowed to know any information about my job. I cannot tell you. Why can't I know? You're my dad. It's hard to explain, but it's none of your business, okay? You are forbidden from asking me any more questions about my job. Fine, I got it. I have to find out where that basement is. I've checked every door in here and none of them lead to a basement. Did that bookshelf just move? No way, this is a secret entrance to the basement? I mean, he's still in his room. What the hell is all this? What are you doing down here? Uh, it's forbidden. I was looking for a bathroom. I can take your order when you're ready. Can I just get a number six? Of course. Is that all? Yeah. Uh, we give out a free dum-dum with each order. Thanks. Hey, what can I- Wait, weren't you here yesterday too? You remember me? I don't think I could forget. Let me guess, you want to get a number six. How did you know? I have no idea. It must have been <laughs> luck. And here's your dum-dum. Have a good day. Thank you. Aw, oh, look, it's my favorite customer. Stop, you're making me blush. So, what's your name? If you don't mind that, I'm asking. It's Bailey. I don't mind. My name's Lucas. You should try the number one instead. It's my favorite. You know what? Sure. Enjoy the dum-dum and have a good day. You too. I can help who's next. Oh, hi. Where's Lucas? He moved to a different location. He doesn't work here anymore. Um, do you think you could tell me the new location that he works at? No, I can't disclose that information. Sorry. Could you move if you don't mind? There's people in line behind you. Wait, but what about the free dum-dum with each order? I'm sorry, we don't do that here. I'm never going to be able to find him again. There's like 300 locations just in my area. Are you excited to start your new job today? Yes, I can't wait to meet everyone. You'll be amazing, don't worry. Thanks. Hi everyone, welcome to your first day on the job. I'll give you guys a few minutes to get to know your coworkers. Um, excuse me, have we met before? I'm not sure. I don't think so. I'm sorry, it's just that you look really familiar for some reason. Maybe we met before or something. Well, anyway, my name is Bailey. I go by my middle name, Will. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Okay, everybody, it's time to get started with the work day. See you later. Yeah, of course. Whoa, did you design that by yourself? Uh, yeah, I did. It's beautiful. You have a lot of talent. Thank you. I appreciate that. Now that I think of it, I definitely remember you from somewhere. I'm sure we'll figure it out at some point. Hopefully. This is going to bother me for the rest of the day. We were lucky enough today to get a catered lunch for every single one of you. <gasps> they have dum-dums! <laughs> uh, Bailey, is something wrong? Lucas? My mouth tastes like salmon. Who eats fish for breakfast? Oh my god, I don't think that's fair. Why are you chugging water like a toddler? Are you okay? No! I think my soulmate's doing something that I really don't want to be a part of. What could they possibly be doing? Never mind. I thought this was cherry. Why does it taste alcoholic? Who does shots at 2 p.m., bro? Get a grip! <coughs> <coughs> oh my god. Please don't tell me that was the devil's lettuce. Is my soulmate Chuck Bass? I'm so confused. Your soulmate is really putting you through it, huh? I am going through it and I'm afraid of what's next. My soulmate just ate mochi. It was so good. Oh, this one's really weird. It tastes like um like metal a little bit. Why would they eat metal? Oh my god! Sis, did you forget to flush the toilet again? It stinks. She's not even home. What is that? Do they live on a farm? Oh, why does it smell like that? I'm just gonna do this for the rest of the day. 
Hey guys, what's up? Dude, why are you plugging your nose like that? You don't want to know. You can't just hold your nose for the rest of the day. Yes, I can, and I will. I won't talk to you if you keep doing that. <sighs> I regretted that immediately. What are you freaking out about? It smells like pee. It's not your soulmate's fault. They're probably just walking outside. But I have to deal with it too. Not the fish again. Oh, I know what they're doing. They're a freak. What the f I can't do this anymore. Ah, uh -uh, why is it spicy? You are being so dramatic. I'm gonna throw up. Headphones, what? I don't want these. Wait, did these let me hear what my soulmate is hearing? I love being nosy. The total today for your hemorrhoid cream is 100. I don't think I was supposed to hear that conversation. Maybe it'll be better this time. Bro, did you ever get that crazy rash on your ass figured out? I think I'm gonna put these away. My soulmate was looking at engagement rings for me. An engagement ring? But you haven't even met yet. I heard him tell the seller he was buying it for his soulmate. So has your soulmate said anything fun? I don't know, I haven't put them on yet. Are you crazy? Put them on right now. Mm. You have to hear what they're doing. Okay. Oh yeah, baby, that's the spot. Ah! What, what were they saying? Is it bad? I gotta go, I'm gonna go wash out my ears with bleach. I can be adopted by a billionaire or a baker. Hey, what does billionaire mean? It must be someone who has like a billion friends. Wow, okay. Oh my, why have they given me a clearance child? And what are you wearing? I don't know. Go put this on this instant. This seems fancy. Yes, well, it's better than the Walmart clothes you're wearing. Much better. And this is our butler, Gerald. He'll take care of whatever you want. You have to get me anything I ask for? Yes, miss, that's right. Can I have an electric guitar? Yes, I will get on that right now. Here you go, one electric guitar. Sweet, thank you. So, what do you do for a job? Uh, I run a very big business. What kind of business? This is not bonding time. You don't need to know. I will not answer any personal questions about myself. Now go sit down for dinner. The private chef has made a five course meal. For dinner tonight, we're having escargot. Isn't that like the bottom of a plane? Oh my, no, that's cargo. Escargot is snails. Snails? I don't want to eat snails. Then you may have some caviar instead. What's caviar? Well, it's fish eggs. Do you guys have, like, chicken tenders? No, of course we do not have chicken tenders. Bro, you're seriously eating a snail right now. Good for you, Slay. We're going to need a tutor to fix your grammar immediately. What's wrong with how I talk? You sound like you have three brain cells total. Tomorrow you will be starting at a private school. Cool. At my old school, one of the teachers got arrested for money laundering. Okay, let's not repeat that again. It's a school for the rich and talented. Every person there is gifted. I am neither of those things. This will be your uniform. There's a uniform? Of course there's a uniform. It's a private school. I'm gonna look like a dork. That's great. I hope so. You look so much better. I look silly. Well, that's because you didn't button it up all the way. See, isn't that great? This is worse. Now, now, we have to get going. Class, this is our new student, Bailey. Hey, guys. Hey, isn't your father crazy, Mr. Carlson? Mm -hmm. I don't know. He seems pretty nice to me. Do you know what he does for work? He won't tell me anything about his job. Yeah, because he does super illegal things. My father gave me Wagyu when I asked for escargot. Can anyone trade? Mm, no, I can't. How about you, new girl? I have a Lunchable for lunch. Anyway, have you been down into your basement yet? The basement? Yeah, dude, everyone is always talking about what he keeps down there. No, I didn't even know that we had one. You need to go down there and tell us about all the crazy things. Like what? I'm assuming you had a great first day of school. It was fine, I guess. Have you made any worthy friends? You could say that. Can I ask you something? Of course, as long as it's not about my job. Well... No, you are not allowed to know any information about my job. I cannot tell you. Why can't I know? You're my dad. It's hard to explain, but it's none of your business, okay? You are forbidden from asking me any more questions about my job. Fine, I got it. I have to find out where that basement is. I've checked every door in here and none of them lead to a basement. Did that bookshelf just move? No way, this is a secret entrance to the basement? I mean, he's still in his room. What the hell is all this? What are you doing down here? Uh, it's forbidden. I was looking for a bathroom. Guess the song for $10 million? I'm gonna be so good at this. 90% of my brain is song lyrics. I'm a doll, but I still wanna party. <gasps> I just heard this, it was in the Barbie movie. It has to be Barbie World. 
Yes, I am totally gonna win. You have a peanut brain. There's no way you can win. Yeah, you wanna bet? Yeah, whoever loses has to clean the entire house for a year. Deal. 100 bands of chanel -y. What? Is that like a kind of pasta? Oh my god, why are you shaking your ass? Um, because I'm trying to get famous on TikTok. I'm dancing to Ice Spice's new song. Deli! This is way too easy. At least give me something hard. Why does it feel like I'm never enough? I feel like I've heard that somewhere before. Oh, runner up. Duh. Won't somebody give me the antidote? I have never heard that before. How am I supposed to guess? Better figure it out or I'll win. How did you only get one brain cell today? <laughs> it's like there's no thoughts in your head. Do you just think of sparkles and rainbows? Yes. Bailey, you got a zero on your test. You just wrote slave for every answer. Hmm. On this one, you didn't even write anything. You just drew a smiley face. You look so pale. Here, put on some blush. Um, what are you doing? That is definitely not how you're supposed to use it. It goes on your face. You know what? Yeah, you're doing great, sweetie. Try this lip gloss instead. Okay. No, you just have to twist to open it. None of these things are edible. They're for your face. Not your teeth. You need to wipe that off. Drink this to get it off your teeth. What the fuck? You're supposed to drink it out of the top? Okay, what? Please, please stop doing that. I will be right back. Don't do anything stupid while I'm gone. Okay. What? Who gave her a lighter? She lit her hair on fire. You got two brain cells? It doesn't look like the second one is doing much. Hey, Bailey, you have to listen to everything I say today, okay? Okay. Guys, this is my life-size Malibu Barbie doll. Give them away. Whoa. Whoa. So oh my god, I want one. She even has some signature slogans. Roast beef. I don't think that's one of them. How about we try a different phrase? Are you my daddy? Sorry, she must be malfunctioning or something. Let's just try a nice normal one. Boobies. Okay, seriously, what are we, fourth graders? Oh, she can do some tricks too. Show them. Um, why is she making that face? <laughs> Ew, what the fuck? So if she's like a robot doll, she must be smart. What's the capital of the U.S.? Barbie land. Um, no, that's not the capital. Mommy milkers. Why is she looking at me like that? I will kill your entire family. Finally, you got brain cells today. The Eiffel Tower has 1,710 steps. Bitch, what? Watching TV burns 10% more calories than sleeping. Wait a second. Tell me another fun fact. Flamingos can only eat with their heads upside down. You're like a walking encyclopedia. Follow me right now. That sounds delightful. First to guess how many jelly beans are in this Ferrara gets to keep it. So how many jelly beans are inside the car? 1,425,789. That's exactly right. Enjoy your new Ferrari. Wait, can you do my homework too? Done. How did you finish that in two seconds? Huh, what else do you know? A pig's orgasm lasts for 30 minutes. Okay, maybe let's not repeat that one. How many licks does it take to get to the center of a Tootsie Pop? 364. This is so cool. You know everything. Human corpses can continue to move for a year after death. Okay, someone turn her off now. You can't be stupid again today. You have to lead us in the debate. Those seven brain cells better do the work. Bro, she cannot compete. She's as smart as a toenail. Hey, Bailey, what you doing? Magic. Yeah, we're screwed. I'd like both parties to present themselves to everyone. Hi, I enjoy sleeping and eating. Dude, what? This is gonna be such an easy win. I love pineapple on pizza. Give me your thoughts on saving the economy. I believe we should replace currency with selfies. Interesting take, how would that work? Sexy selfies are worth more than ugly selfies. Wow, that's brilliant. If you could elect one person to become president, who would it be? Taylor Swift. Good job, that was the only right answer. Bailey has won the debate for her team. This has got to be a prank. Where are the cameras? Sis, I swear, if you make the bathroom smell that bad again. Okay, sorry, I won't. Everyone can't see me or everyone can't hear me. I feel like I could use being invisible for a day. I am so glad Bailey's not here today. I genuinely hate her. Me too. She's so annoying. Fake ass bitch. Why is there a dick on your face? What? What do you mean? Class, settle down and get that off of your face. Ass hat. Hey, who said that? Mary. Huh? What? The answer is 76. Where is that voice coming from? I'm a genie and I'm going to get you 100% on this test. Really? Thank you so much. Do people still feel if I hit them? Ow, what the fuck? Quiet, we're testing. Marissa, why did you answer in the shape of a Christmas tree? Because the magic genie told me to do it this way. <laughs> wow, okay, how about we take you to get some help?
Hey, sis. Oh my God, what is that smell? That McDonald's bag has been in here since like 2012. I think that just burned all the hair off the inside of my nose. Yes, I was not done being invisible. Bro, I just matched with the finest girl on Tinder. Does your girlfriend Bailey know that? No, of course not. Dude, why would you pour that on me? It looks like I pissed my pants. <laughs> it wasn't me. Where did that laugh come from? I can't believe the teacher thought I was crazy yesterday. The genie was real. <laughs> Ow, bitch. Why would you push me? I didn't push you. You little bitch. All right, everyone. Today, we will be having a pop quiz. Everyone, please take out a pencil. And Okay, who did that? It's not funny. No one's by the light switch. We have a ah! song. Pretty people can't oh die. Oh, my gosh, no. I'm too young to die. <laughs> really? That's it? Who even cares? It's just hair. This game is such a joke. Sis, can I do something for a task? Yes, but why do you have scissors? I need to cut your hair. Why would you need a piece of my hair? Hm, I don't know. That's <laughs> creepy. Why would I do that? I mean, if it wants me to, I will. Where are you going with my hair? Uh, don't worry about it. It's a task. The last 10 are the hardest. Be careful. I'm really not worried about that. DNA results will be back in three days. Okay, thank you. Hi, um, I'm here for my results. You're the girl from three days ago. Come with me to the back. Why? I'll tell you when we're back there. Listen, you are not who you think you are. I'm sorry, I'm not following here. Do you know the story of that lost royal family? Yeah, who doesn't know that story? Your DNA matched up with the queen. What? Don't tell me you think I'm royalty. There is no what if. Your DNA lined up perfectly. Just let me see the test. I cannot give this to you. I'm sorry. Why? I, it's confidential. You just can't have it. But I need it. If I give you this document, you have to rule. Rule what? You have to give up your everyday life and rule all of us as royalty. I guess I really don't have a choice. Do not tell anyone you got that from me. Okay, I won't. Break in? I'm going to get arrested, thank you. But they left the door open? Idiots. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Ma'am, what are you doing in here? Um, housekeeping. Yeah, right. Wait, no, please, I can explain. I am a princess. Oh my god, you're right. Your eyes. My eyes? My eyes? What do you mean, my eyes? Come with me right now. We have something to do. Okay. Uh, where are we going? We're going to walk in there and stop the family meeting. Oh, uh, we're going to what? I mean, we can't just barge in that's like rude, right? No, the crown must go to the rightful ruler. <laughs> Everyone, the lost princess has been found. <laughs> Hi. This is ridiculous. I mean, look at the way she's dressed. She's emo. Who says a princess can't be emo? She's not fit to be royalty with that attitude. But look at the color of her eyes. That can't be. They are almost identical to her mother's. Her mother? Guards, I want this girl out of here, right now. I'm going to overrule you guys. You can't just proclaim things like that. Well, I just did. She's kind of badass. Apparently, I am the rightful ruler, and I want to take that place. That's not going to happen. I don't believe you. I need proof. Fine. Show her my DNA test. But this test says that there's two from the royal bloodline. Two? What do you mean two? Do you have any siblings? Not half ones. Yeah, I have a full sister. There's no way. You both are royalty. What? How is it possible that both of you ended up together? I don't know. We were left on a doorstep. Your sister must agree to rule with you. Mm, there is no way my sister is going to do that. Well, who wouldn't want to be royalty? Her. Yeah, she's kind of a bitch. You must at least try. Okay, but I'm warning you, it's not gonna work. I'll be back in with my sister to overrule you. Whatever, get her out of my sight. Mm -hmm. Sis, I have something to tell you. Okay, that didn't sound good. You know how we were adopted? Yeah, of course. Yes, yeah, so we're actually part of the lost royal family. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I already knew that. I'm sorry, what do you mean that you already knew? Oh, because we were left with a blanket that had the royal crest on it. And you didn't think to tell me at any point. No, because I don't want to be royalty. But you have to be. Where is this all coming from? How did you find out? It's part of my task, okay? We both need the money. Just come with me. We won't need it if we're royalty. 
so I'm so crazy. close to finishing. Please. Only if you give me 25% of the prize. Fine. Oh, uh, you're back? Yeah, I am. And you brought your sister. Sup, motherfuckers? Tonight we will have the ceremony to officially crown you guys. Tonight? You guys cannot just kick us out like this. <laughs> it's already too late. Congratulations, you are now crowned. This is the craziest thing to ever happen to us. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Do I have to keep this on like all the time because it really hurts my head? <laughs> really? That's it? Who even cares? It's just hair. This game is such a joke. Sis, can I do something for a task? Yes, but why do you have scissors? I need to cut your hair. Why would you need a piece of my hair? Hm, I don't know. That's <laughs> creepy. Why would I do that? I mean, if it wants me to, I will. Where are you going with my hair? Uh, don't worry about it. It's a task. The last 10 are the hardest. Be careful. I'm really not worried about that. DNA results will be back in three days. Okay, thank you. Hi, um, I'm here for my results. You're the girl from three days ago. Come with me to the back. Why? I'll tell you when we're back there. Listen, you are not who you think you are. I'm sorry, I'm not following here. Do you know the story of that lost royal family? Yeah, who doesn't know that story? Your DNA matched up with the queen. What? Don't tell me you think I'm royalty. There is no what if. Your DNA lined up perfectly. Just let me see the test. I cannot give this to you. I'm sorry. Why? I, it's confidential. You just can't have it. But I need it. If I give you this document, you have to rule. Rule what? You have to give up your everyday life and rule all of us as royalty. I guess I really don't have a choice. Do not tell anyone you got that from me. Okay, I won't. Break in? I'm going to get arrested. Thank you. They left the door open? Idiots. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Ma'am, what are you doing in here? Um, housekeeping. Yeah, right. Wait, no, please, I can explain. I am a princess. Oh my god, you're right. Your eyes. My eyes? My eyes? What do you mean, my eyes? Come with me right now. We have something to do. Okay. Uh, where are we going? We're going to walk in there and stop the family meeting. Oh, we're going to what? I mean, we can't just barge in. That's like rude, right? No, the crown must go to the rightful ruler. <laughs> Everyone, the lost princess has been found. <laughs> Hi. This is ridiculous. I mean, look at the way she's dressed. She's emo. Who says a princess can't be emo? She's not fit to be royalty with that attitude. But look at the color of her eyes. That can't be. They are almost identical to her mother's. Her mother? Guards, I want this girl out of here. Right now. I'm going to overrule you guys. You can't just proclaim things like that. Well, I just did. She's kind of badass. Apparently, I am the rightful ruler, and I want to take that place. That's not going to happen. I don't believe you. I need proof. Fine. Show her my DNA test. But this test says that there's two from the royal bloodline. Two? What do you mean two? Do you have any siblings? Not half ones. Yeah, I have a full sister. There's no way. You both are royalty. What? How is it possible that both of you ended up together? I don't know. We were left on a doorstep. Your sister must agree to rule with you. Mm, there is no way my sister is going to do that. Well, who wouldn't want to be royalty? Her? Yeah, she's kind of a bitch. You must at least try. Okay, but I'm warning you, it's not gonna work. I'll be back in with my sister to overrule you. Whatever, get her out of my sight. Mm -hmm. Sis, I have something to tell you. Okay, that didn't sound good. You know how we were adopted? Yeah, of course. Yeah, so we're actually part of the lost royal family. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I already knew that. I'm sorry, what do you mean that you already knew? Oh, because we were left with a blanket that had the royal crest on it. And you didn't think to tell me at any point? No, because I don't want to be royalty. But you have to be. Where is this all coming from? How did you find out? It's part of my task, okay? We both need the money. Just come with me. We won't need it if we're royalty. I'm so close to finishing, please. Only if you give me 25% of the prize. Fine. Oh, uh, you're back? Yeah, I am. And you brought your sister. 
Sup, motherfuckers? Tonight we will have the ceremony to officially crown you guys. Tonight? You guys cannot just kick us out <laughs> like this. It's already too late. Congratulations, you are now crowned. This is the craziest thing to ever happen to us. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Do I have to keep this on like all the time because it really hurts my head? How did you only get one brain cell today? <laughs> it's like there's no thoughts in your head. Do you just think of sparkles and rainbows? Yes. Bailey, you got a zero on your test. You just wrote slave for every answer. Mm -hmm. On this one, you didn't even write anything. You just drew a smiley face. You look so pale. Here, put on some blush. Um, what are you doing? That is definitely not how you're supposed to use it. It goes on your face. You know what? Yeah, you're doing great, sweetie. Try this lip gloss instead. Okay. No, you just have to twist to open it. None of these things are edible. They're for your face. Not your teeth. You need to wipe that off. Drink this to get it off your teeth. What the fuck? You're supposed to drink it out of the top? Okay, what? Please, please stop doing that. I will be right back. Don't do anything stupid while I'm gone. Okay. What? Who gave her a lighter? She lit her hair on fire. You got two brain cells? It doesn't look like the second one is doing much. Hey, Bailey, you have to listen to everything I say today, okay? Okay. Guys, this is my life-size Malibu Barbie doll. Give them away. Whoa. Whoa. So oh my god, I want one. She even has some signature slogans. Roast beef. I don't think that's one of them. How about we try a different phrase? Are you my daddy? Sorry, she must be malfunctioning or something. Let's just try a nice normal one. Boobies. Okay, seriously, what are we, fourth graders? Oh, she can do some tricks too. Show them. Um, why is she making that face? <laughs> Ew, what the fuck? So if she's like a robot doll, she must be smart. What's the capital of the U.S.? Barbie land. Um, no, that's not the capital. Mommy milkers. Why is she looking at me like that? I will kill your entire family. Finally, you got brain cells today. The Eiffel Tower has 1,710 steps. Bitch, what? Watching TV burns 10% more calories than sleeping. Wait a second. Tell me another fun fact. Flamingos can only eat with their heads upside down. You're like a walking encyclopedia. Follow me right now. That sounds delightful. First to guess how many jelly beans are in this Ferrara gets to keep it. So how many jelly beans are inside the car? 1,425,789. That's exactly right. Enjoy your new Ferrari. Wait, can you do my homework too? Done. How did you finish that in two seconds? Huh, what else do you know? A pig's orgasm lasts for 30 minutes. Okay, maybe let's not repeat that one. How many licks does it take to get to the center of a Tootsie Pop? 364. This is so cool. You know everything. Human corpses can continue to move for a year after death. Okay, someone turn her off now. You can't be stupid again today. You have to lead us in the debate. Those seven brain cells better do the work. Bro, she cannot compete. She's as smart as a toenail. Hey, Bailey, what you doing? Magic. Yeah, we're screwed. I'd like both parties to present themselves to everyone. Hi, I enjoy sleeping and eating. Dude, what? This is going to be such an easy win. I love pineapple on pizza. Give me your thoughts on saving the economy. I believe we should replace currency with selfies. Interesting take. How would that work? Sexy selfies are worth more than ugly selfies. Wow, that's brilliant. If you could elect one person to become president, who would it be? Taylor Swift. Good job, that was the only right answer. Bailey has won the debate for her team. This has got to be a prank. Where are the cameras? Oh, of course you would get 69 brain cells. We have to go, come on. Slay! Bailey, you're giving a tour to the freshmen today. Give me one margarita, I'ma open my legs. Let's not encourage the freshmen to do that. Is our tour guide okay? Why is she biting a makeup brush? Carrot and cottage cheese. I'm scared to go to high school because I'm ugly and everyone bullies me. That's so real. Aren't you supposed to tell me it'll be better? Does that mean you think I'm ugly? Duh! Yeah. What? Duh! Yeah. You don't have to yell. So, does this school have a mascot? I'm just Ken. Sweet, I want a Mojo Dojo Casa house. Does everyone in high school act like this? Bailey, I'm gonna have to revoke your position as tour guide. This is so sick and fucking twisted! Um, what is that? A crystal. Okay, please leave. I don't want to go to high school. Did she just dab? Hey, yo, she got the moves. Mom, can you come pick me up? Yes, finally you're smart again. A cockroach has the ability to live for one year without its head. Okay, anyway, come with me. I have an idea. Welcome to Jeopardy. Today's contestants are Bailey and Steve. What do you call a group of giraffes? 
What is a tower? Yes, that's correct. What is the largest type of frog? What is a Goliath frog? That is also correct. What is the name of the dragon that helps Mulan? Who is Mushu? Looks like we have a winner. I didn't even get to answer anything. Congratulations, Bailey. You won $2 million. The dollar bill was invented in 1862. Do you know which lottery ticket is the winning one? That one. Oh my God, you're right. We just won the jackpot of $10 million. It's like you're a robot. Scotland chose the unicorn as its national animal. Uh, that's cool, I guess. Humans spend an average of one year on the toilet in their lifetime. Ew! How are you so smart but so stupid at the same time? Fruit Loops are all the same flavor, despite their different colors. What? My whole life has been a lie! Four brain cells? Are you kidding me? You're basically a toddler. Spaghetti. This is gonna be a long day. Is there even, like, a single thought behind those eyes? I smell like beef. Okay, so the answer is no. Bailey, put the fire down right now. Bad, bad girl. Oh my god, please, please do not cry. It's fine, I'm sorry, <laughs> okay? Everyone will need to draw a portrait for their art final. Slay the house down. Everyone, please show me. Uh, Bailey, you literally made handsome Squidward. See. Si. Why don't you try again and just draw the first thing that comes to your mind right now? Murder. Okay, maybe not that. Seriously, how do you even keep getting a lighter? Put it down. Oh, you're smart. Can you please take my midterm for me? I'm gonna fail. In five years, you're gonna start balding. Um, what? How do you know that? I know everything in the universe. Like you can see into the future? Am I finally gonna get a boyfriend? No, but you will adopt 13 cats. Are you kidding me? I don't want to die alone. Please tell me that you're lying. I'm incapable of lying. Everyone, I'm selling psychic readings for $20. Am I gonna have my dream job in five years? You'll be living in your parents' basement with a receding hairline. My hairline can't recede, I already have a big forehead. Can you tell me something cool about the future? Taylor Swift will be elected president in 2030. <gasps> Sweet! Tommy is my boyfriend! What kind of job am I gonna have? You'll go viral on TikTok for using Gorilla Glue to glue a wig down. Wait, that's such a good idea. It'll stay forever then. What about me? Where will I be? You'll be dead. What? You've got to be kidding. Why would you say that? I'm just kidding. I thought that you couldn't lie. Or am I? Bailey, thank gosh you're here. Is there a tampon in your nose? Take that out right now. Put on this apron and get to work. We need you. cha 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 kong -a. Stop messing around. Put your apron on the right way. Is butter a carb? I'm losing brain cells just talking to you. Hi, can I please get an iced latte? I like apples and bananas. Wow, that's great. Um, are you gonna make my coffee? I don't want that, you just took a sip out of it. Oh, sorry. Dude, what the fuck? Do you guys have any baristas that aren't insane? Could I get a number six, please? Are we even real? Okay, I came here for food, not an existential crisis. Yummy, yummy. Is this a joke? Are you trying to poison me right now? Because I will call corporate on you. Let me speak to your manager. Okay, one second. What are you doing? Hi, I'm the manager. Oh, you think you're so funny, huh? I'm gonna give you guys one star on Yelp. You are acting like a child. <gasps> An ugly, pimply bitch. Hello. Finally, are you gonna be normal today? I'm Peppa Pig. <sighs> and this is Daddy Pig. <sighs> nope, you're still weird. Today, you're babysitting the neighbor kids. You can take a ride on my big green tractor. I feel so sorry for them. Hey, what are you holding? You put this up your... Okay, let's not tell the kids that. Where do babies come from? I don't know. I looked up pictures on Google and it was really scary. What's two plus two? Oh, six. I'm not good at math, but I definitely don't think it's six. Can you get me a drink? I'm thirsty. Um, that's peanut butter. At this point, I feel like I'm babysitting you. Can we play Barbies together? No, no, that is not how you play with a Barbie. You have to be nice to her. Oh my god. Mom, can you please come home right now? I'm so scared. How'd you even get the Barbie to stay like that? Abracadabra. I think your six brain cells are just doing the Cotton Eye Joe in there. Hello, and welcome to your Harvard interview. Hola, me amo Bailey. You're bilingual? That's amazing. I seem to have lost my pen. Do you have one I could borrow? How did you fit a lamp into your bag? You're a wizard, Harry. And you have a sense of humor. Great. You are Kenneth. We love people that support mental health. Tell me something about yourself. Bill, 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 Bill Nye, the science guy. Oh my gosh, I'm a huge Bill Nye fan too. Slugs are just divorced snails. I've never thought about it that way. It's true. Do you have any other talents? I want to ride. I want to ride. Horseback riding. I love it. Of course you do. What is your greatest strength? Gaslighting. Persuasive. We would love to offer you a spot at Harvard in the fall. Do you want to play mermaids? I've been waiting for that question my whole life. I don't exist. Um, what, what are you doing?
Oh, wait, Annie sounds kind of cute. I could go with that. So what name did you get? Oh, it says Annie Rection. Bailey, are you serious? I think you need to read that one more time. What? What do you mean? Do you hear what you're saying? Annie Rection. Oh! <gasps> Oh, decline. Oh my God, I can't believe I almost accepted that. You need to figure out how to read, apparently. Whatever. Remember, you can only decline two times. I know, but the next one has to be better than that. Yeah, you better hope so. Ben. I mean, that's usually a boy's name, but I could go by Ben. What is it this time? Ben Dover. Girl, you have got to be kidding me, right? Not again. Oh, hey, Amanda. Yeah, that's not my name anymore. It's Taylor Swift now. That's the name you got? Yeah, isn't it awesome? What did you get? You don't want to know. Please be good. PP time. I don't want to be called PP. Sis, please tell me there's another way to change my name. There is, but you're not going to like it. Tell me how to change my name. I can't be called PP time forever. The only way that you can change your name now is to go and steal one from someone else. What? I'm not doing that. I knew you would say that. What happens if I just hit the decline button again? No, no, you cannot do that. Why not? Because your name will be completely randomized. It might be better. Or it could be like way worse. Fine, how do I steal a name? All you need to do is slap someone in the face and their name transfers over to you. Hey, Taylor. Oh, hey, girl, what's going on? Dude, why did you just slap me? You said that would work. Okay, I was just kidding. I didn't know you were really going to do it. <clears throat> Sorry, I think your only choice is just to hit decline. Okay. Please. Mike Hunt. Whoa, I'm sorry. What did you just say? Mike Hunt. That's what it says. Do you hear yourself? Mike Hunt. I can't even say that with a straight face. You should have took pee pee time. I know that now. There has to be someone I can talk to to fix this. Try going to their headquarters here. Hi, I'm- Take a ticket and wait in the line. Your number will be called. Okay. Number 69, Mike Hunt. Please don't call me that. So, what seems to be the problem? All of the names that I got were prank names. That's odd. Was it every name you got? That is definitely not right. We'll fix it for you. Really? Amazing. According to our database, someone hacked into your name system. Why would someone do that? To block you from getting your true identity. Have you met your family before? I live with them? No, I mean like your birth family. I'm sorry to tell you this, but I think you were kidnapped as a kid. What? What are you talking about? Well, you look exactly like Queen Meredith did when she was young. Okay, and a lot of people look alike. It's uncanny, but the whole family died in a car accident. Princess Sophia is still alive. Yes, but I believe that you are her. No, the system already gave that name away to the girl who it belonged to. That's what I'm trying to tell you. It didn't belong to her. It belongs to you, and that's why they blocked it. What? But why would someone want to steal my identity? To uncover the fortune of the royal family. How much money are we talking about? Seven billion dollars. We have to stop them, right? Today we want you to go home and do not say anything. Why would I do that? Because we're gonna come take care of it. Hey, sweetheart, I'm so sorry about the terrible name you got. It's fine, I can just make a nickname. FBI, open up! Quick, grab Sophia, we need to get out of here right now. I can be adopted by a billionaire or a baker. Hey, what does billionaire mean? It must be someone who has like a billion friends. Wow, okay. Oh my, why have they given me a clearance child? And what are you wearing? I don't know. Go put this on this instant. This seems fancy. Yes, well, it's better than the Walmart clothes you're wearing. Much better, and this is our butler, Gerald. He'll take care of whatever you want. Do you have to get me anything I ask for? Yes, miss, that's right. Can I have an electric guitar? Yes, I will get on that right now. Here you go, one electric guitar. Sweet, thank you. So, what do you do for a job? Uh, I run a very big business. What kind of business? This is not bonding time, you don't need to know. I will not answer any personal questions about myself. Now go sit down for dinner, the private chef has made a five course meal. For dinner tonight, we're having escargot. Isn't that like the bottom of a plane? Oh my, no, that's cargo. Escargot is snails. Snails? I don't wanna eat snails. Then you may have some caviar instead. What's caviar? Well, it's fish eggs. Do you guys have like chicken tenders? No, of course we do not have chicken tenders. Bro, you're seriously eating a snail right now. Good for you, Slay. We're going to need a tutor to fix your grammar immediately. What's wrong with how I talk? You sound like you have three brain cells total. 
Tomorrow you will be starting at a private school. Cool. At my old school, one of the teachers got arrested for money laundering. Okay, let's not repeat that again. It's a school for the rich and talented. Every person there is gifted. I am neither of those things. This will be your uniform. There's a uniform? Of course there's a uniform. It's a private school. I'm gonna look like a dork. That's great. I hope so. You look so much better. I look silly. Well, that's because you didn't button it up all the way. See, isn't that great? This is worse. Now, now, we have to get going. Class, this is our new student, Bailey. Hey, guys. Hey, isn't your father crazy, Mr. Carlson? Mm -hmm. I don't know. He seems pretty nice to me. Do you know what he does for work? He won't tell me anything about his job. Yeah, because he does super illegal things. My father gave me Wagyu when I asked for escargot. Can anyone trade? Mm, no, I can't. How about you, new girl? I have a Lunchable for lunch. Anyway, have you been down into your basement yet? The basement? Yeah, dude, everyone is always talking about what he keeps down there. No, I didn't even know that we had one. You need to go down there and tell us about all the crazy things. Like what? I'm assuming you had a great first day of school. It was fine, I guess. Have you made any worthy friends? You could say that. Can I ask you something? Of course, as long as it's not about my job. Well... No, you are not allowed to know any information about my job. I cannot tell you. Why can't I know? You're my dad. It's hard to explain, but it's none of your business, okay? You are forbidden from asking me any more questions about my job. Fine, I got it. I have to find out where that basement is. I've checked every door in here and none of them lead to a basement. Did that bookshelf just move? No way, this is a secret entrance to the basement? I mean, he's still in his room. What the hell is all this? What are you doing down here? Uh, it's forbidden. I was looking for a bathroom. Dude, I got tickets to a rock concert tonight. Wanna come with? I don't know. Rock music isn't really my thing. Ugh, no wonder your innocence is 100%. Wait, I'll come with you. <gasps> Great, but you're not wearing that. My outfit is fine. I like being comfortable. <laughs> you're gonna regret that. Tickets, please. Oh, honey, Disney on Ice is next door. Actually, I'm here for the rock concert. Oh, okay, then go ahead. You sure you don't want the outfit? Give it to me. You look so cool, and where did you get the boobs? Shut up. Jessica, I didn't know that you were coming. Oh my god, hey guys. Lucky you, we have two extra backstage passes. Do you want them? We'll take them. Come on guys, let's meet the band. Uh, excuse me miss. Hmm? I think that you dropped this. Oh, uh, thank you. Dude, that was the lead singer of the band. What does the paper say? It has a phone number and it says, call me for a good time. Dude, you have to call him. No way, that's out of my comfort zone. Ugh, no wonder your score is so high. You're no fun. Come on, let's just go watch the show. Wait, guys. I can't call him because I'm a virgin. What? We can't hear what you're saying. I'm a virgin. Yeah, no shit. We could have guessed that ourselves. You never know. Maybe he doesn't want to hook up with you. He wrote call me for a good time. What else does that mean? Either you call him or I'll do it for you. Fine, I'll call him after the show. Thank you guys so much for the support. Have a great night. Don't look at me like that. I'm gonna call him. Hello, who is this? Uh, hi, this is the girl from backstage. Oh good, I was hoping that you would call. Come meet me in my dressing room backstage. Uh, yeah, sure. Oh hey, come on in. I wanted to talk to you. Hi, what's up? So, have you ever thought about becoming a singer before? I, I mean, I was in chorus, but not really. Our lead singer had a family emergency and she's gonna be gone for three weeks. Hang on a minute, are you asking me to be in the band? Kinda, I want you to come to our tryouts later this week. Your style's cool, I think you'd make a great addition. Okay, maybe I will. Bro! Oh, were you guys eavesdropping? Yeah, we had to. You are definitely trying out. Guys, I don't even know if I can sing or not. Do you want to get your innocence score lower or not? Guys, I can't sing this song. This has a bad word in it. You're not a toddler. You can swear. You're freaking out about nothing. That was so good. Okay, I guess the worst they can say is no. Okay, this is actually happening. I'm really scared. You practice for this. You're going to be just fine. Next in line for auditions, please. Wish me luck. Is this some kind of joke? I'm not being called ugly forever. Decline. Sis, I already accepted my name, the first one. Really? What was it? Sandra, isn't that pretty? Like that girl from Greece? That's so cute. 
My first one was ugly. Oh, well, you accepted it, right? No, why would I accept it? I mean, it's true. You are ugly. No. Be careful. Don't run out of choices. Please. I'm sure the next one's going to be better than that. Anything is. Another one? Short stuff? I'm not even that short. I'm 5'3". The third one better be good. Hey, mom, do you know what happens when you run out of name choices? We don't know. Some people think that you die. Oh. Uh, why are you asking? I've already declined two of them. They were terrible. You cannot decline the third one, whatever you do. Please don't be fat. Please. Idiot? My last one cannot be idiot. I can't take that. This name is your final option. You have to accept it. I don't want to be called idiot for the rest of my life. You really don't have a choice at this point. Well, what really happens when you run out of names? No one's ever run out, but you could die. That seems a little dramatic. I don't think you should be the one to find out. I'm gonna do it. Please don't kill me. I'm okay. Good. What happened with your name? Um, hello. What happened to the name? It picked one for me instead. Your reaction's making me think it's not good. It says car accident. <laughs> That's not even a name. There's got to be some way I can change that, right? <laughs> not that I know of, car accident. Become nameless. You should just become nameless. I don't know if I want to have no name forever. Well, what is the other option? Being called car accident. There has got to be some way I can change it myself. I know where you can go. Bro, where did you come from? Don't worry about that. You need to go to this address alone. You want me to pull up to a random sketchy address alone? I promise they can change your name for you. Okay, I'll do it. Mm. At the door, the password is cheese. Cheese? Really? Okay. Um, oh. Hello, what's the password? Uh, cheese? Oh, yes, come right this way. So, what do you want? I need to change my name, like, really badly. I can do that, but you're gonna have to pay. Pay, like, how much money? No, not with money. The only way to get a new name is to steal one from someone you know. What? Dude, I got tickets to a rock concert tonight. Wanna come with? I don't know. Rock music isn't really my thing. Ugh, no wonder your innocence is 100%. Wait, I'll come with you. <gasps> Great, but you're not wearing that. My outfit is fine. I like being comfortable. <laughs> you're gonna regret that. Tickets, please. Oh, honey, Disney on Ice is next door. Actually, I'm here for the rock concert. Oh, okay, then go ahead. You sure you don't want the outfit? Give it to me. You look so cool, and where did you get the boobs? Shut up. Jessica, I didn't know that you were coming. Oh my god, hey guys. Lucky you, we have two extra backstage passes. Do you want them? We'll take them. Come on guys, let's meet the band. Uh, excuse me miss. Hmm? I think that you dropped this. Oh, uh, thank you. Dude, that was the lead singer of the band. What does the paper say? It has a phone number and it says, call me for a good time. Dude, you have to call him. No way, that's out of my comfort zone. Ugh, no wonder your score is so high. You're no fun. Come on, let's just go watch the show. Wait, guys. I can't call him because I'm a virgin. What? We can't hear what you're saying. I'm a virgin. Yeah, no shit. We could have guessed that ourselves. <laughs> you never know. Maybe he doesn't want to hook up with you. He wrote, call me for a good time. What else does that mean? Either you call him or I'll do it for you. Fine, I'll call him after the show. Thank you guys so much for the support. Have a great night. Don't look at me like that. I'm gonna call him. Hello, who is this? Uh, hi, this is the girl from backstage. Oh good, I was hoping that you would call. Come meet me in my dressing room backstage. Uh, yeah, sure. Oh hey, come on in. I wanted to talk to you. Hi, what's up? So, have you ever thought about becoming a singer before? I, I mean, I was in chorus, but not really. Our lead singer had a family emergency, and she's going to be gone for three weeks. Hang on a minute. Are you asking me to be in the band? Kinda. I want you to come to our tryouts later this week. Your style's cool. I think you'd make a great addition. Okay, maybe I will. Bro! Oh, were you guys eavesdropping? Yeah, we had to. You are definitely trying out. Guys, I don't even know if I can sing or not. Do you want to get your innocence score lower or not? 
Guys, I can't sing this song. This has a bad word in it. You're not a toddler. You can swear. You're freaking out about nothing. That was so good. Okay, I guess the worst they can say is no. Okay, this is actually happening. I'm really scared. You practice for this. You're gonna be just fine. Next in line for auditions, please. Wish me luck. <sighs> I need to brush my teeth. My breath stinks. <sighs> Why do I look like Christina Aguilera? 2007, that was like a lot of years ago. Is this real? Sis, let's go. You're gonna be late for school. School? I can't go to school like this. You look fine. Stop being dramatic. Let's go. Are you guys texting on blackberries? Duh, blackberries are so cool right now. I heard that they're coming out with this thing called the iPhone and there's no buttons on it. Like the first iPhone? It's supposed to be a huge deal. Did you guys see that Rihanna just released a new song? Really? Which one? It's called Umbrella. I really like it. Have you heard it? Yeah, it's great. Oh, I hope that my crush likes my new post. Oh, where did you post it? TikTok? Um, what's that? I posted it on MySpace. Please don't put me in 2007 again. Oh, great. We went even further back in time? Wow, that is a lot of glitter. And why are my lips so pale? Bailey, your makeup looks so good today. I love the eyeshadow. Uh, yeah, thanks. I think my mom's gonna get us the new gaming system coming out. What gaming system? It's called the Xbox 360. I'm excited. That sounds super cool. Can't wait. It's so futuristic. Wait, do you guys know who Taylor Swift is? No, does she go to school here or something? Ugh, I love Kanye West so much. You like Kanye West? Yeah, his new song Gold Digger just came out. I am obsessed with it. Mm. Could you feed my Tamagotchi while I go to the bathroom? I don't want it to die. I would love to. Want to come over after school? We're going to drink beer and watch VHS tapes. You know what? I'm good. Okay, I just want 2011. What? 2002, I was an infant. What happened to my eyebrow? What are you talking about? They look great. I have like six hairs left. Yeah, thin eyebrows are all the rage right now. I love them. Do you at least have something to fix my lips? Why would you need to fix them? You're already wearing lip gloss. Now let's go. Please tell me you're not using a Nokia. This is the best phone on the market right now. What else would I use? I have the biggest crush on Justin Timberlake. Who's your crush? Uh, Harry Styles. Who the hell is Harry Styles? He was a skater boy, she said see. You know that song? Yeah, it came out like a month ago. I'm so obsessed with it. I keep hearing it on the radio. Yeah, me too. You, everyone run, it's Jessica. She is so emo. What's wrong with being emo? 2011, at least I can have an iPhone now. Avril, what are you doing? We're gonna be late. Where am I? Hey, are you ready yet? We have to leave for your interview, like now. Interview about what? Don't play dumb about your new single, what the hell? Give me one second. I thought I was waking up in different years, not different bodies. Am I a part of the conspiracy theory? You have 30 seconds, let's go. Coming. Are you sure that you're ready for this interview? You seem kind of off. Yeah, I am so ready. I've never been more ready in my life. Excuse me, Avril, I am such a big fan. Could you sign this? Sure. There you go. Um, I think that you spelled your name wrong. No, I didn't. Everyone, please welcome Miss Avril Lavigne. How do you feel about the release of your new single? Good. Uh, how was your experience making this song in the studio? Ah, great. How do you feel about being so iconic in the pop punk space? Amazing. I'm scared to even look. 2012, why would I need to be in 2012? Taylor, are you done in there? We need to go. Who's Taylor? Don't tell me I'm in someone's body again. Miss Swift, you've been in there 40 minutes. Miss Swift, no. There you are, the car is waiting for you outside. Where are we going? To your live performance, don't tell me you forgot. Great. You know, I'm not feeling too well. I don't think a live performance is a good idea. Are you kidding me? This is gonna be huge, you have to do it. Stop goofing around, now follow me and we can go. Mm, coming. Can't we just like switch to an interview? <laughs> what is wrong with you today? Are you feeling all right? Nothing, I'm fine. You have five minutes in the dressing room and then we'll be- Dude, I got tickets to a rock concert tonight. Wanna come with? I don't know, rock music isn't really my thing. Ugh, no wonder your innocence is 100%. Wait, I'll come with you. <gasps> Great, but you're not wearing that. My outfit is fine, I like being comfortable. <laughs> you're gonna regret that. Tickets, please. Oh, honey, Disney on Ice is next door. Actually, I'm here for the rock concert. Oh, okay then, go ahead. 
You sure you don't want the outfit? Give it to me. You look so cool. And where did you get the boobs? Shut up. Jessica, I didn't know that you were coming. Oh my god, hey guys. Lucky you, we have two extra backstage passes. Do you want them? We'll take them. Come on guys, let's meet the band. Uh, excuse me, miss. Hmm? I think that you dropped this. Oh, uh, thank you. Dude, that was the lead singer of the band. What does the paper say? It has a phone number and it says, call me for a good time. Dude, you have to call him. No way, that's out of my comfort zone. Ugh, no wonder your score is so high. You're no fun. Come on, let's just go watch the show. Wait, guys. I can't call him because I'm a virgin. What? We can't hear what you're saying. I'm a virgin. Yeah, no shit. We could have guessed that ourselves. <laughs> you never know. Maybe he doesn't want to hook up with you. He wrote call me for a good time. What else does that mean? Either you call him or I'll do it for you. Fine, I'll call him after the show. Thank you guys so much for the support. Have a great night. Don't look at me like that. I'm gonna call him. Hello? Who is this? Uh, hi, this is the girl from backstage. Oh, good. I was hoping that you would call. Come meet me in my dressing room backstage. Uh, yeah, sure. Oh, hey, come on in. I wanted to talk to you. Hi, what's up? So, have you ever thought about becoming a singer before? I, I mean, I was in chorus, but not really... Our lead singer had a family emergency and she's going to be gone for three weeks. Hang on a minute. Are you asking me to be in the band? Kinda. I want you to come to our tryouts later this week. Your style's cool. I think you'd make a great addition. Okay. Maybe I will. Bro! Oh, were you guys eavesdropping? Yeah, we had to. You are definitely trying out. Guys, I don't even know if I can sing or not. Do you want to get your innocence score lower or not? Guys, I can't sing this song. This has a bad word in it. You're not a toddler. You can swear. You're freaking out about nothing. That was so good. Okay, I guess the worst they can say is no. Okay, this is actually happening. I'm really scared. You practice for this. You're going to be just fine. Next in line for auditions, please. Wish me luck. Is this some kind of joke? I'm not being called ugly forever. Decline. Sis, I already accepted my name, the first one. Really? What was it? Sandra. Isn't that pretty? Like that girl from Greece? That's so cute. My first one was ugly. Oh, well, you accepted it, right? No, why would I accept it? I mean, it's true. You are ugly. <gasps> be careful. Don't run out of choices. Please, I'm sure the next one's going to be better than that. Anything is. Another one? Short stuff? I'm not even that short. I'm 5'3". The third one better be good. Hey, Mom, do you know what happens when you run out of name choices? We don't know. Some people think that you die. Oh. Uh, why are you asking? I've already declined two of them. They were terrible. You cannot decline the third one, whatever you do. Please don't be fat. Please. Idiot? My last one cannot be idiot. I can't take that. This name is your final option. You have to accept it. I don't want to be called idiot for the rest of my life. You really don't have a choice at this point. Well, what really happens when you run out of names? No one's ever run out, but you could die. That seems a little dramatic. I don't think you should be the one to find out. I'm gonna do it. Please don't kill me. I'm okay. Good. What happened with your name? Um, hello. What happened to the name? It picked one for me instead. Your reaction's making me think it's not good. It says car accident. <laughs> That's not even a name. There's gotta be some way I can change that, right? <laughs> not that I know of, car accident. Become nameless. You should just become nameless. I don't know if I want to have no name forever. Well, what is the other option? Being called car accident. There has got to be some way I can change it myself. I know where you can go. Bro, where did you come from? Don't worry about that. You need to go to this address alone. You want me to pull up to a random sketchy address alone? I promise they can change your name for you. Okay, I'll do it. Mm. At the door, the password is cheese. Cheese? Really? Okay. Um, oh. Hello, what's the password? Uh... Cheese? Oh, yes. Come right this way. So, what do you want? I need to change my name, like, really badly. 
I can do that, but you're gonna have to pay. Pay, like, how much money? No, not with money. The only way to get a new name is to steal one from someone you know. What? <gasps> hey, Bailey! You made me mess up my lip gloss. Our ranks are gonna come out. Let's look together. Sweet, I'm under 100th place. I think there's been a mistake. It says that I'm over 1,000. Yeah, I don't care. Suck it up, sorry. Wow, and I thought my rank was really bad. I thought that people liked you. Apparently, they don't. Oh, hey, babe. Hey, I'm breaking up with you because I've decided to replace you with her instead. Sorry, didn't mean to hurt you. I guess I'm single now, but I still have my best friend. I mean, I'm definitely your best friend. I know that I can get my place higher than this. Ugh, I'm gonna trip. Do you need some help carrying all that? That would be amazing. Here, you can take this. Shit, I forgot to do the homework. Do you want to look at mine? I did it. Oh my gosh, yes, thank you. Bailey, are you letting her cheat off you? No, she was just asking for help. That's it, pop quiz for the whole class. Boo, you suck. Boo. Why does it feel like I'm never enough? I think we can help each other. How would we help each other? I want you to be in a fake relationship with me so people will get off my back about being single. No way, this isn't to all the boys I've left before. Listen, I'm the quarterback, and if you date me, your rank will immediately become higher. Deal. Hey guys, this is my girlfriend. You're dating him? Yeah, I am. You know, I forgive you for getting me detention yesterday. Great, then we can be friends. Yeah, definitely. See, I told you this was going to work. Are you guys running for prom queen and king? Uh, I don't know about that. Yeah, of course we are. I did not agree to this. Okay, then you can continue to be a loser. How did my rank move up that quickly? Um, it's because you're dating me. Everyone loves me. Your head is so big, I'm surprised it doesn't fall off. Hey, sis, wait up. Get away from me or I'll punch you in the gut. Did I do something wrong? Yes, dude, you took my spot. What do you mean I took your spot? I used to be under 100 and now I'm not because of you. Sis, I didn't mean to take your spot. I'm sorry. Get away from me. I don't want to talk to you. Doesn't it feel good having a higher rank than before? It doesn't. Hey, we're all going to hang out after school. You should totally come. Oh, and Bailey, you can come if you want, I guess. I'll pass. Just so you know, I'm totally voting for you for prom queen. Oh, uh, thank you. But your boyfriend is still way cooler than you and you'll never be like him. You're going to be so popular after we win. I don't know if that's what I want. Hey, we had a deal and you are not about to back out on me right now. Okay. Everyone vote for me for prom queen. Sis, you're running for prom queen too? Can you hear? That's literally what I just said and I'm running against you. You're never gonna be enough and I'll prove that to you by winning. What is your problem? I gotta go. What? Why is my rank dropping? Um, there's a video of your so-called boyfriend making out with Mary earlier today. Oh no. If he's the one who cheated, then why is my rank dropping? Because everyone knows you're faking the relationship. What? It's not fake. You guys don't go near each other and you've never kissed. No one really believes you're a couple. Fine, I'll prove it to you. Hey, babe. Uh, oh, uh, hey. Just so you guys know, we're actually in an open relationship. We are? Sweet. I am so sorry that I misjudged you. Yeah, you should be. That was a good save. What were you thinking? That Mary was hot and I wanted to make out with her. Mom, it's tomorrow. Don't do anything stupid again. Oh, you're the one yelling now? Uno reverse. Mary, what the fuck? I told you to make sure they broke up. You sabotaged me? Oh, hey. Yeah, I sent Mary over to kiss your boyfriend. Hey, guys, just so everyone knows, my boyfriend is actually hosting a pre-prom party, and you're all invited. Woo! I'm so excited. Oh, yeah. Wait, what? I didn't know that we were throwing a party. We are now. This is not over yet. Okay, so where are we throwing this party? Your house. What? I don't want to have all these people over at my house. Don't worry, it'll only be like 50 people. Okay, fine, but that's it, all right? I don't know about this. The first people are here. Hey, guys. Hey, what's up, Bailey? Is it cool that I brought the whole football team with me? Yeah, it's totally cool. Come on in. Oh, my God, hey. Hey, girls, come on in. This is so cool of you. Dude, there's like 500 people here. Relax, it's gonna be so worth it when we win. No, you can't throw up in that vase, it was my mother's. That looked expensive. I love this party you got going on. What are you doing here? Everybody at school was going, so I was too. Last time I checked, you are definitely not on the list, so I'm gonna need you to leave. Dude, are you being serious right now? You're gonna kick me out? Yeah, see you later. Damn, don't need to knock so loud, I'm coming. Hello? Hello, ma'am, this is the sheriff's department. Are you the owner of this home? We've received complaints. Nope, it's his house. Bro, what the fuck? How are you gonna throw me under the bus like that? Guys, relax, it's just a noise complaint. Keep it down, okay? Oh, okay, yeah, we can keep the noise down. Enjoy your prom night.
No, you were supposed to shut it down. Of course you would be behind this. And why are you even still here? Oh, I was peeing in that bush outside. You're in second and I'm right behind you. Better watch your back. Mm. I'm not worried. Wow, you look- Don't? I was just trying to be nice. Are you positive that we're gonna win? Oh yeah, I'm positive about it. How do you know? Yeah, that's because I rigged all the ballots so we would win. What? You rigged it? Shh! It all worked out. You wanted to be more popular and now you're second forever. What? I don't want to be second. Well, you'll never be better than me. Everyone, it's time to announce our prom king and queen. Your prom king for 2023 is Jack Daniels. Thank you guys, I never would have seen this coming. And for prom queen? Oh, it looks like there's been a tie. A tie? No, there can't be a tie. You're not in the tie. You didn't even make it to the finals. The tie that you have is with Misty Daniels. Who's Misty? Uh, my sister. I didn't know you had a sister. Yeah, I try not to tell people. I don't see Misty anywhere. So, Bailey, do you want to come get your crown? Okay. Here you go. Would you like to say anything to the crowd? Yeah, I would. A week ago, I would have cried with this crown on my head. But now that I'm up here, all I can think is... Why does it even matter? I think all of you are special and beautiful in your own way, so really this crown belongs to everyone. Bailey, what are you doing? I'm doing what's right. Everyone, Jack cheated the system so that we would win. No, <gasps> whoa, oh my gosh. gosh. I would rather have no friends than friends that don't care about me, so this rank means nothing to me at all. Looks like it doesn't matter anymore. The ranks are gone. It's gone? You were right. We don't need it. How did you only get one brain cell today? <laughs> it's like there's no thoughts in your head. Do you just think of sparkles and rainbows? Yes. Bailey, you got a zero on your test. You just wrote slave for every answer. <laughs> on this one, you didn't even write anything. You just drew a smiley face. You look so pale. Here, put on some blush. Um, what are you doing? That is definitely not how you're supposed to use it. It goes on your face. You know what? Yeah, you're doing great, sweetie. Try this lip gloss instead. Okay. No, you just have to twist to open it. None of these things are edible. They're for your face. Not your teeth. You need to wipe that off. Drink this to get it off your teeth. What the fuck? You're supposed to drink it out of the top? Okay, what? Please, please stop doing that. I will be right back. Don't do anything stupid while I'm gone. Okay. What? Who gave her a lighter? She lit her hair on fire. You got two brain cells? It doesn't look like the second one is doing much. Hey, Bailey, you have to listen to everything I say today, okay? Okay. Guys, this is my life-size Malibu Barbie doll. Give them a wave. Whoa. Whoa. She's so cool. Oh my god, I want one. She even has some signature slogans. Roast beef. I don't think that's one of them. How about we try a different phrase? Are you my daddy? Sorry, she must be malfunctioning or something. Let's just try a nice normal one. Boobies. Okay, seriously, what are we, fourth graders? Oh, she can do some tricks too. Show them. Um, why is she making that face? <laughs> Ew, what the fuck? So if she's like a robot doll, she must be smart. What's the capital of the U.S.? Barbie land. Um, no, that's not the capital. Mommy milkers. Why is she looking at me like that? I will kill your entire family. Finally, you got brain cells today. The Eiffel Tower has 1,710 steps. Bitch, what? Watching TV burns 10% more calories than sleeping. Wait a second. Tell me another fun fact. Flamingos can only eat with their heads upside down. You're like a walking encyclopedia. Follow me right now. That sounds delightful. First to guess how many jelly beans are in this Ferrari gets to keep it. So how many jelly beans are inside the car? 1,425,789. That's exactly right. Enjoy your new Ferrari. Wait, can you do my homework too? Done. How did you finish that in two seconds? Huh, what else do you know? A pig's orgasm lasts for 30 minutes. Okay, maybe let's not repeat that one. How many licks does it take to get to the center of a Tootsie Pop? 364. This is so cool, you know everything. Human corpses can continue to move for a year after death. Okay, someone turn her off now. You can't be stupid again today. You have to lead us in the debate. Those seven brain cells better do the work. Bro, she cannot compete. She's as smart as a toenail. Hey, Bailey, what you doing? Magic. Yeah, we're screwed. I'd like both parties to present themselves to everyone. Hi, I enjoy sleeping and eating. Dude, what? This is going to be such an easy win. I love pineapple on pizza. Give me your thoughts on saving the economy. I believe we should replace currency with selfies. Interesting take. How would that work? Sexy selfies are worth more than ugly selfies. Wow, that's brilliant. If you could elect one person to become president, who would it be? Taylor Swift. Good job, that was the only right answer. Bailey has won the debate for her team.
This has got to be a prank. Where are the cameras? Oh, of course you would get 69 brain cells. We have to go. Come on. Slay. Bailey, you're giving a tour to the freshmen today. Give me one, Margarita. I'm gonna open my legs. Let's not encourage the freshmen to do that. Is our tour guide okay? Why is she biting a makeup brush? Carrot and cottage cheese. I'm scared to go to high school because I'm ugly and everyone bullies me. That's so real. Aren't you supposed to tell me it'll be better? Does that mean you think I'm ugly? Duh! What? Duh! You don't have to yell. So, does this school have a mascot? I'm just Ken. Sweet, I want a Mojo Dojo Casa house. Does everyone in high school act like this? Bailey, I'm gonna have to revoke your position as tour guide. This is so sick and fucking twisted! Um, what is that? A crystal. Okay, please leave. I don't want to go to high school. Did she just dab? Hey, yo, she got the moves. Mom, can you come pick me up? Yes, finally, you're smart again. A cockroach has the ability to live for one year without its head. Okay, anyway, come with me. I have an idea. Welcome to Jeopardy. Today's contestants are Bailey and Steve. What do you call a group of giraffes? What is a tower? Yes, that's correct. What is the largest type of frog? What is a Goliath frog? That is also correct. What is the name of the dragon that helps Mulan? Who is Mushu? Looks like we have a winner. I didn't even get to answer anything. Congratulations, Bailey. You won $2 million. The dollar bill was invented in 1862. Do you know which lottery ticket is the winning one? That one. Oh my God, you're right. We just won the jackpot of $10 million. It's like you're a robot. Scotland chose the unicorn as its national animal. Uh, that's cool, I guess. Humans spend an average of one year on the toilet in their lifetime. Ew! How are you so smart but so stupid at the same time? Fruit Loops are all the same flavor, despite their different colors. What? My whole life has been a lie! Four brain cells? Are you kidding me? You're basically a toddler. Spaghetti. This is gonna be a long day. Is there even, like, a single thought behind those eyes? I smell like beef. Okay, so the answer is no. Bailey, put the fire down right now. Bad, bad girl. Oh my god, please, please do not cry. It's fine, I'm sorry, okay? <laughs> Everyone will need to draw a portrait for their art final. Slay the house down. Everyone, please show me. Uh, Bailey, you literally made handsome Squidward. See. Why don't you try again and just draw the first thing that comes to your mind right now? Murder. Okay, maybe not that. Seriously, how do you even keep getting a lighter? Put it down. Oh, you're smart. Can you please take my midterm from me? I'm gonna fail. In five years, you're gonna start balding. Um, what? How do you know that? I know everything in the universe. Like you can see into the future? Am I finally gonna get a boyfriend? No, but you will adopt 13 cats. Are you kidding me? I don't wanna die alone. Please tell me that you're lying. I'm incapable of lying. Everyone, I'm selling psychic readings for $20. Am I gonna have my dream job in five years? You'll be living in your parents' basement with a receding hairline. My hairline can't recede, I already have a big forehead. Can you tell me something cool about the future? Taylor Swift will be elected president in 2030. <gasps> Sweet! Karma is my boyfriend! What kind of job am I gonna have? You'll go viral on TikTok for using Gorilla Glue to glue a wig down. Wait, that's such a good idea. It'll stay forever then. What about me? Where will I be? You'll be dead. What? You've got to be kidding. Why would you say that? I'm just kidding. I thought that you couldn't lie. Or am I? Bailey, thank gosh you're here. Is there a tampon in your nose? Take that out right now. Put on this apron and get to work. We need you. cha 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 Conga! Stop messing around. Put your apron on the right way. Is butter a carb? I'm losing brain cells just talking to you. Hi, can I please get an iced latte? I like apples and bananas. Wow, that's great. Um, are you gonna make my coffee? I don't want that. You just took a sip out of it. Oh, sorry. Dude, what the fuck? Do you guys have any baristas that aren't insane? Could I get a number six, please? Are we even real? Okay, I came here for food, not an existential crisis. Yummy, yummy. Is this a joke? Are you trying to poison me right now? Because I will call corporate on you. Let me speak to your manager. Okay, one second. What are you doing? Hi, I'm the manager. Oh, you think you're so funny, huh? I'm gonna give you guys one star on Yelp. You are acting like a child. <gasps> An ugly, pimply bitch. Hello. Finally, are you gonna be normal today? I'm Peppa Pig. <sniffs> and this is Daddy Pig. <sniffs> nope, you're still weird. Today, you're babysitting the neighbor kids. You can take a ride on my big green tractor. I feel so sorry for them. Hey, what are you holding? You put this up your- Okay, let's not tell the kids that. Where do babies come from? I don't know. I looked up pictures on Google and it was really scary. What's two plus two? Oh, six. I'm not good at math, but I definitely don't think it's six.
Can you get me a drink? I'm thirsty. Um, that's peanut butter. At this point, I feel like I'm babysitting you. Can we play Barbies together? No, no, that is not how you play with a Barbie. You have to be nice to her. Oh my God. Mom, can you please come home right now? I'm so scared. How'd you even get the Barbie to stay like that? Abracadabra. I think your six brain cells are just doing the Cotton Eye Joe in there. Hello, and welcome to your Harvard interview. Hola, me amo Bailey. You're bilingual? That's amazing. I seem to have lost my pen. Do you have one I could borrow? How did you fit a lamp into your bag? You're a wizard, Harry. And you have a sense of humor. Great. You are Kenneth. We love people that support mental health. Tell me something about yourself. Bill, 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 Bill Nye, the science guy. Oh my gosh, I'm a huge Bill Nye fan too. Slugs are just divorced snails. I've never thought about it that way. It's true. Do you have any other talents? I want to ride. I want to ride. Horseback riding. I love it. Of course you do. What is your greatest strength? Gaslighting. Persuasive. We would love to offer you a spot at Harvard in the fall. Do you want to play mermaids? I've been waiting for that question my whole life. I don't exist. Um, what, what are you doing? I can be adopted by a billionaire or a baker. Hey, what does billionaire mean? It must be someone who has like a billion friends. Wow, okay. Oh my, why have they given me a clearance child? And what are you wearing? I don't know. Go put this on this instant. This seems fancy. Yes, well, it's better than the Walmart clothes you're wearing. Much better. And this is our butler, Gerald. He'll take care of whatever you want. Do you have to give me anything I ask for? Yes, miss, that's right. Can I have an electric guitar? Yes, I will get on that right now. Here you go, one electric guitar. Sweet, thank you. So, what do you do for a job? Uh, I run a very big business. What kind of business? This is not bonding time, you don't need to know. I will not answer any personal questions about myself. Now go sit down for dinner, the private chef has made a five course meal. For dinner tonight, we're having escargot. Isn't that like the bottom of a plane? Oh my, no, that's cargo. Escargot is snails. Snails? I don't want to eat snails. Then you may have some caviar instead. What's caviar? Well, it's fish eggs. Do you guys have, like, chicken tenders? No, of course we do not have chicken tenders. Bro, you're seriously eating a snail right now. Good for you, Slay. We're going to need a tutor to fix your grammar immediately. What's wrong with how I talk? You sound like you have three brain cells total. Tomorrow you will be starting at a private school. Cool. At my old school, one of the teachers got arrested for money laundering. Okay, let's not repeat that again. It's a school for the rich and talented. Every person there is gifted. I am neither of those things. This will be your uniform. There's a uniform? Of course there's a uniform. It's a private school. I'm gonna look like a dork. That's great. I hope so. You look so much better. I look silly. Well, that's because you didn't button it up all the way. See, isn't that great? This is worse. Now, now, we have to get going. Class, this is our new student, Bailey. Hey, guys. Hey, isn't your father crazy, Mr. Carlson? Mm, I don't know. He seems pretty nice to me. Do you know what he does for work? He won't tell me anything about his job. Yeah, because he does super illegal things. My father gave me Wagyu when I asked for escargot. Can anyone trade? Mm, no, I can't. How about you, new girl? I have a Lunchable for lunch. Anyway, have you been down into your basement yet? The basement? Yeah, dude, everyone is always talking about what he keeps down there. No, I didn't even know that we had one. You need to go down there and tell us about all the crazy things. Like what? I'm assuming you had a great first day of school. It was fine, I guess. Have you made any worthy friends? You could say that. Can I ask you something? Of course, as long as it's not about my job. Well... No, you are not allowed to know any information about my job. I cannot tell you. Why can't I know? You're my dad. It's hard to explain, but it's none of your business, okay? You are forbidden from asking me any more questions about my job. Fine, I got it. I have to find out where that basement is. I've checked every door in here and none of them lead to a basement. Did that bookshelf just move? No way, this is a secret entrance to the basement? I mean, he's still in his room. What the hell is all this? What are you doing down here? Uh, it's forbidden. I was looking for a bathroom. 